This is the instructional video for Munch's MAK-18 and MAK-18S extrusion welders. The machine comes complete with a Teflon shoe, stand, handle, and instruction manual. Place the gun on the stand. Locate the nozzle warming plate and slide it onto the front of the stand. Tighten down the thumb screw. The warming plate should be close to the Teflon shoe. Locate the sliding mount nut on the side of the barrel and screw in the handle. The handle can be set in a variety of different positions. Tighten the handle to lock it in place. The MAK-18's nozzle can spin 360 degrees, allowing you to weld at any angle. Hot air from the preheat flows out by the Teflon shoe. Loosen the Allen screw to adjust or remove the shoe from the nozzle. A snap ring must be removed if you want to take the preheat guide off. Set the shoe at the desired angle and tighten the screw. Plug the machine into a 220 volt power source. Select the type of material to weld using the arrow buttons. Press the check button to confirm and then select the rod size. Use the down arrow to select the material temperature. Adjust it with the up and down arrows. Press the check button. Use the up arrow to select the air temperature. Adjust with the up and down arrows. Press the check button. The lower left corner of the display shows the number of seconds before you can activate the drive motor and begin welding. To cool down the gun, push the back arrow button for the main menu. The MAK-18 and the MAK-18S have different control units. On the S, the left hand dial sets preheat and material temperature, while the right hand dial controls the extrusion output speed. Welding rod feeds into the extruder from the side of the barrel. Two adjustment screws help control the feed for different size rod as well as softer rod. The trigger lock button is located down on the handle. Push to lock the trigger in place. To unlock, squeeze the trigger once. Before welding, prep your material using a scraper and wipe away any excess. To hold the material in place, you might want to tack it together first using a quick L or other hot air tool. Lay down a steady bead of plastic as you move the extruder along the welding path in the direction of the preheat. After the weld, make sure to cool down the machine. Thank you for using Munch's MAK-18.